So I think that it's important that like kids keep talking about it and like realizing that it's okay to like have those emotions. When a parent is diagnosed with cancer, it leaves kids with a lot of questions and difficult emotions. Our tenders reporter Amanda Brandeis shows us how a Chula Vista brother and sister have used their own pain to help other children just like them. Draw on the paper plate a representation of how you felt. When you're 13 going on 14 and getting ready to start high school, there's plenty to stress about. Cancer shouldn't be one of them. I was really scared that like they were going to die or and I was sad and like upset that like it happened like to both of them. Like. Both parents diagnosed within months of each other. Her mom breast cancer and her dad throat cancer. They weren't like how they usually are and I don't know, I felt like they weren't like there for me the way they usually are. Sophia Epley and her brother Vincent suddenly felt emotions they'd never experienced. They had questions but didn't know how or who to ask. When someone has cancer, you, like you think about them first, you don't really think about like the effects it has on the kids as well. Sophia wanted to create a safe place for kids to go and teamed up with the Sharp Tool of Vista Barnhart Cancer Center to make it happen. 11 year old Tyler Schwer attended the first session. Love you. His mom was diagnosed with breast cancer last year. When I first got the news, I was shocked. His mom is grateful for the group and says it's already making an impact. The next day as we're driving to school, he says, Mom, so, do I carry the gene? And mom, can I get cancer? And you know, those are questions that he had never asked before the group. Here, kids can talk about anything without fear of being embarrassed or judged. I think it's really important that we start like recognizing that it affects everybody in the family. While navigating cancer can feel lonely, Sophia wants kids to know it doesn't have to be. Amanda Brandeis, 10 News. Amanda tells us that support group is led by a clinical social worker and held every first Monday of the month at Sharp Chula Vista Barnhart Cancer Center. Sessions are free and open to all families, regardless of where they're receiving treatment.